You know, when it comes to crappie fishing, I'll tell you what, uh, the upbite is so important and how to detect the upbite. Because a lot of times what happens is crappies will come up underneath the bait and just kind of pick the bait up and come like that. And uh, you, need, you need to have some type of a strike indicator or some way to know that that bite is happening. And the best way, what I'm doing is I'm using a uh, rocket bobber. I'm using a, a panfish series rocket bobber. I've got a bobber stop set up at about uh, six feet, seven feet right now. And I'm using a 16th ounce jig with a two inch power tail. Okay, so what's going to happen is I'm going to cast this out. I'm going to use this bobber. It's average casting distance of 30 to 40 yards, so I can cover some water. So number one, I'm going to use it as a, uh, as a means to get my, uh, my bait out there, a delivery system. Okay, I'm going to cast out, and as that jig drops, it falls like that, eventually it'll get to the stop, and this bobber is going to stand up vertical. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to slowly just work this bait back to the boat so I'm gonna raise my rod tip up like that which raises the jig up and then I'm gonna just drop my rod tip and the jig will fall again and then the bobber's gonna stand vert vertical okay now when a crappie comes and grabs his bait and the upbite happens what's gonna happen is this bobber's gonna just lay flat like that that's the upbite and then okay I can detect the upbite just simply by when I see that bobber lay flat I know that crappie grabbed it he's coming up with it and I can set the hook if a gill grabs it a lot of times that bobber standing vertical will just go straight down so let's give it a shot okay what I'm gonna do is cast out I'm using that bobber as a delivery system now. Average cast and distance is 30 to 40 yards. Okay, once that jig's all the way down to my stop, the bobber's gonna stand vertical. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is, now I'm gonna use it as a jigging platform. I'm just gonna pull up like this, which raises that jig up. Now I'm gonna drop my rod tip and let it fall. Now if that bobber just drops straight down, a lot of times that's a gill. But if it lays flat, that's a crappie with the upbite. Okay, now I'm just going to raise it up again, let it fall. And we grabbed it right there. That was a crappie that grabbed it on the drop. Where did he grab it? It's a nice fish. Real nice fish. Yeah, I just seen that bobber lay down. There's a crappie grabbing it on the upweight. Feels like a good crappie too. Oh, that's a nice crappie. It's a big crappie. The old upbite crappie. I'll tell you what, you see a lot of these do this. Man. I'll tell you what. If you can find if you can find a bobber to detect the upbite, you can get get on some serious crappies. Take a look at that crappie. Boy, is that a dandy. The upbite. Nice looking crappie. Yeah, let's get you back in there.